Ah, this is one that's most promising. An important detective is missing. Skullduggery is surely afoot. Solve it, and I'll write it up quick as you please. He's a friend of mine. The whole station is out looking for him as we speak. Ironically, he came here on an investigation himself. Seems several people have gone missing in this part of town. We've had reports of missing people over the last few months. Detective Murphy is just the most recent and the only one who's anybody to speak of. I should go back and ask about this. I saw him going into the barber shop when I was on my way to work. In this kind of neighborhood, people come and go. An odd man indeed. He spent a fair amount of time in here poking around. Some people around town just seem to vanish. It is mysterious. George delivers that to us. It's amazing. The flowers just grow and grow. Sweet boy, constantly giving my assistant gifts, a jacket, a handbag, and so on. George is my sweetheart. I think he plans to propose marriage soon. Maybe even today. unusual. I wonder if someone could tell me more about this. Shopish. He was in here asking about missing people. Yes. Bought a meat pie, he did. Stayed and chatted for a few minutes, then headed off to the barber. I'm told that some people have gone missing, but I don't know anything about it. George delivers meat for my pies. Lovely lad. I pay on delivery. I believe he picks it up from a local butcher shop. nosing around. I told him to sod off. I pride myself on the quality of the beef I sell. Somebody selling cheap around here, though, my sales have dropped off. George? I don't know any George.
He came in asking lots of questions. I believe I answered them to his satisfaction. I suppose there are a few people I haven't seen in a while. Why would you want to know about him? Stupid boy. He does deliver tan leather on occasion, but I really have very little to do with him. I should reinterrogate a suspect. Step over here and have yeah, I gave him a trim. He asked no end of questions. When I cut his hair, I noticed a tattoo right at the base of his neck. A green Celtic cross, it was. I'm trying to quit drinking. Sometimes my hand shakes when I'm given a shave. You're right. Several people have disappeared over the past months. Some of them were customers of mine. George was in here earlier, getting an haircut. He wanted to look nice for his girl. He's been seeing Joanna from the flower shop for some time now. Said he's finally saved up enough money to pop a question. George, I hoped he'd stop by. I want to see his new haircut. He must be at his house. Oh, I do hope he proposes soon. was coming too close to figuring out where all those people went. <laughs> they got parceled out to the baker, the florist, and me. You very cleverly puzzled that one out. A very unpleasant crime. Up to the Perfect for, for one of Mr. Raymond's penny dreadfuls. Oh. 